Hi, I'm Harleen Hatterman Valenti. I'm a professor and assistant chair at North Dakota State University in Plant Sciences. I'm going to be talking about a trial that we have up at Inkster. Um, this is the third year that we've done this in collaboration with the Northern Crop Insurance Service on hail injury to potatoes. Recently we've had a number of storms come through and so uh, some of this hail has been very destructive and what uh, the National Crop Insurance Service is looking at is how some of the newer varieties, processing varieties such as Clearwater and Bannock compared to our old traditional or more traditional processing uh, variety called Russet Burbank. So we have both of those um, cultivars in the trial and what we've done is we've done various uh, degrees of defoliation not only the leaves but also the stems because hail isn't very specific when it wants to go and injure a crop it'll just really macerate everything um, so our, our removal is up to almost a hundred percent and then we have this at three different timings to see when is the most important time where if hail hit a, a potato field it's going to be the most destructive. So we're looking at hail at that tuber initiation stage, which you have your tubers there, uh, the plants trying to go and reproduce with these tubers. Uh, we then look at early bulking stage, a little bit later, but still what in the past what we found is that's a very important stage where if a uh, field was to get hailed and severely it can do uh, a lot of uh, reduction in size and, and your overall yield and quality. And then lastly is that late bulking stage where we found really the late bulking stage the plant has pretty much produced quite a bit so you're just going to reduce mainly your size on that. But it's really important to know how these new cultivars are going to compare with more of our traditional cultivars. And so, hope to go and show you some of those pictures of how these plants recover um, in North Dakota.